This video will show how to use the review function in Microsoft Word to track changes and add comments to a document. The first thing you'll want to do is turn on track changes. Go up to the review tab and select track changes. You'll know track changes is turned on because it will have a yellow background. Next, under balloons, select show only comments and formatting in balloons. This will show other changes you make to the document such as adding and deleting words within the body of the document. That's all you need to do. Now you're ready to make your changes. I'm going to go up to the Home tab and I'm going to select the title of this document. I'm going to change the font to a larger size and italicize it. Notice Microsoft Word is tracking my changes in the markup area to the right hand side of the document. Another way that Microsoft Word indicates a change has been made is with this vertical line on the left hand column. That will show that a change has been made. When I add a word to the document, it's indicated with a different colored font and it's underlined. If I delete a word, that's shown with a strike through by Microsoft Word. I can also move around sentences or paragraphs and Microsoft will keep track of that as well. I'm going to move this paragraph by right clicking, selecting cut, and moving my cursor to where I want to paste it. I right click again and select paste. Notice that Microsoft Word shows this change in green instead of red. This is to show that the cut and the paste that I just did are related. If you've just noticed, when I hover over a change, a balloon pops up and shows me who made the edit to the document, what time the edit was made, and what the edit was that was made. This is another way to keep track of various changes in a document. If I want to, I can also add comments to the document so that the next person who reviews the document can see those comments. I go up to the Review tab, I place my cursor where I want to add the comment, and select New Comment. Once I've made all of my changes and my comment, my document is ready to, to save and to send on to the reviewer. But I'm not quite done yet. I've decided that I actually want to delete this particular comment. If I want to delete the comment, I go back over to the markup area, select the comment. You'll notice it's also selected because it highlights the area where the comment was added and under Comments on the Review tab, I select the Delete button. This removes the comment. Now my document's ready to go on to the reviewer. I'll save it and send it on.